We was in the house watching the Tennessee game and heard the bang, came out. The family was running to the, our porch yelling, he shot my baby, he shot my baby. Immediately, I got my phone, called 911, came, we came out. My husband had to guard the little girl until the rescue people got here. Uh, I was holding the family back, trying to tell them you can't touch her, you can't touch her. Uh, having to keep a mama away from her baby, being a mama, is really hard. That is the most difficult thing I've ever done. The little boy's mama opened the back door, asked what happened, we all told her, she slammed the door, locked it, and went back in the house, and we didn't, we never seen her after that. In her grief and disbelief that the mama of the little boy wouldn't come outside to check on her, she did hit the window and break it, which I don't blame her. I mean, I, I probably would have done the same thing. You gave her a towel. I gave her a towel because she had blood on her hands and stuff like that. I gave her a blanket because it was in the evening, it was getting cool, and she was very distraught. Very. Everybody you talked to indicates there was no angry words. Everybody, was... even the even the children that witnessed it, the little girl's sister and the little girl's friend, there was nothing. They was playing, talking, 